Hi guys, I want to show you something that's a really useful feature in Toon Boom Harmony 14 and I don't know what other versions it's available in but I uh, found it's really useful for stuff. It's called Shift and Trace and what it does is the following. So I've got a drawing uh, let me show you what I got drawing here and a drawing there. This is my buddy's drawing we're doing a little animated short. So I'm busy doing it in between here. And now it's going to be a mission for me to try and in between this thing nicely and neatly because there's just so many shapes happening here. Even though I could kind of wing it a bit. A better way for me to do it is called shift and trace. So I'm going to work off this drawing and my new drawing. So I'm going to select them both. Right click. And go to drawing and send drawings to desk. Now the drawing desk is supposed to, I guess, mimic an old school animation table. I select my new drawing here. I've made sure shift and trace is enabled. And then I click on that shift and... What is that? Shift and trace manipulator. That's what I want. And what that's going to let me do is um, move things around. I can scale it here if I want. Just to, as if I was moving some paper over an animation desk, because I want to reference this thing. Um, I want to reference his face, right? So I've got that, and then I go draw my nice lines here. I'm using a Wacom Cintiq 22-inch uh, HD model, by the way. And what the difference between just moving the drawing in the drawing view is shift and trace is not a permanent move so it's cool for just doing temporary transformations to your drawing just to help you get the size right and get the shapes looking all right there we are now I press escape and see, I've kind of, I'm out of the drawing desk now. And I've got my in-between. That's it. And you can select a whole bunch of drawings to go to the drawing desk. Uh, and you can flip between them. Really great. Bye-bye.